rain showers right now making their way through and uh, most of these will be focused through the morning hours and on the light side as well. Uh, let's check in right now. Most of these focused over parts of southern Illinois. We've got one little band trying to make its way into southeast Missouri as well, but uh, most of these have been across southeastern Illinois right now through Hardin County southward as well through uh, looks like maybe Massac County and Pope County. Some light rain showers possible. Rose of Claire over towards Elizabethtown. You've seen a, a few move through the Cave and Rock area now crossing the Ohio River into Crittenden County, Kentucky over towards Marion uh, in western Kentucky. Farther to the north and west, we've got some light rain that continues to make its way into, say, Mount Vernon back over towards uh, Waltonville and then westward as well into Perry County, anywhere from Tamaro back towards Pinckneyville and Decoin and possibly from Christopher Benton over towards INS Esser and the uh, Bonnie area that are all moving to the east. So McLeansboro, you guys will see the light rain continuing to move into your neck of the woods here shortly. We do expect most of the rain showers to be focused through the morning hours. Eventually, we'll actually see some sun Sunshine this afternoon and temperatures are going to begin to warm up winds today out of the south and west and looking ahead to Thursday and Friday those southwest winds push temperatures to near record levels Thursday afternoon. We are going to be very close to setting a new record here for uh, the early part of December looking ahead to the weekend. Well, temperatures start to cool back just a bit and there is some slightly better chances for some rain as well, but uh, live view from Mount Vernon right now is hoping we could see maybe just a couple raindrops there in the street light, but uh, not the case right now. 45 degrees. Wind chills at times have pushed back into the lower 40. So you probably need a jacket to start. And again, you may want to keep the umbrella handy as well. We do have a stalled front to our north and a weak disturbance bringing some of the wet weather. Most of the rain this morning back into central Illinois from Peoria back over towards Springfield and Decatur. Everything tracking to the east and notice there's not a lot of it out to our west. So this will be around only through the morning hours. That stalled boundary keeping some of the cooler air with temperatures back in the 30s out across the Great Lakes and keeping Keeping it to our north and east. We are on the south side of that front, meaning a lot of warmer air getting pumped up from the south. And talking about the rain showers, warmer temperatures, uh, maybe a shower or two still lingering around through the lunchtime hour in southeastern Illinois. Temperatures there mid to upper 50s. But then once the rain clears out of here, we'll see a little sunshine return. Upper 50s today from Mount Vernon over towards, say, Carmi and Dahlgren. Uh, Carbondale, Murfreesboro, Marion, about 60 to 61 degrees or so, and then into the mid 60s into the Missouri boot heel. And tomorrow morning, waking up back in the low 40s. But tomorrow afternoon, gorgeous day to get outside for this time of year. Upper 60s across southeastern Illinois. We are going to see some 70s, especially into parts of southeast Missouri. We're projecting a high temperature right now in Carbondale, 69 degrees, average high. 50, so about 20 degrees above average. The record 71 set back in 1982. That record on Friday, 77 also set in 82. Maybe a degree or two cooler on Friday, but still we're talking upper 60s for high temperatures. We will cool down this weekend. Temperatures dropping back into the mid 50s for high Saturday and Sunday. Despite being cooler, that is uh, still actually warmer than average for this time of year. So make sure you've got that storm track three app again. Not a lot of measurable rain this morning. Better chances for some wet weather towards the second half of the weekend and then another cool down into the early part of next week. It is going to feel like December by Monday with highs in the mid 40s. Mm. Highs in the mid 40s. Yeah, so wow. The while we've got it. All right. Thank you, Nick.